In English, we use parentheses to indicate clarification for a concept. We add extra information using parentheses. The following rules will help you understand how parentheses are used in mathematics for different purposes. Parentheses are used in mathematics for three main purposes to separate numbers for clarity, to indicate multiplication, and to group numbers together. Parentheses can be used to separate numbers for clarity. For example, if you had an addition problem with a negative number, parentheses would be used to separate the two signs. Parentheses can also be used to separate a number from its exponent. This usually happens if you are raising a negative number to a power. When a number appears next to another number with parentheses, you need to multiply the two numbers. For example, when you see 2, open parenthesis, 3, close parenthesis, you multiply 2 and 3. Think about when you tie your shoes or make a sandwich. You can't put the mustard on your sandwich if you don't have any bread, right? Or maybe you like to have a routine in the morning. Brush your teeth first before you wash your face. Mathematics is the same way. You have to solve mathematical problems in a certain order, called the order of operations. The primary use of parentheses is to group numbers together in mathematical problems. When you see multiple numbers and operations inside parentheses, use the order of operations to solve the problem. The order of operations is 1 parentheses, 2 exponents, 3 multiplication and or division, whichever comes first from left to right, 4 addition and or subtraction, whichever comes first from left to right. You will often hear people say, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. This is a way we remember which operation is done first. If you have a problem with parentheses, you will always evaluate the numbers in the parentheses first. Also, remember to take the order of operations one step at a time. Let's put these parentheses rules to practice with a couple of examples. 50 minus the quantity of 15 plus 9. First, evaluate the numbers inside the parentheses. 50 minus open parenthesis 24 close parenthesis remove the parentheses 50 minus 24 all you have to do now is subtract this gives us 26 ready for one more 29 minus 3 times the quantity of 9 minus 4 again evaluate the numbers inside the parentheses first 29 minus 3, open parenthesis, 5, close parenthesis. There are no exponents. Multiplication comes next in our order of operations. 29 minus 15. Simply subtract to get 14. You can see that it's not so bad if you just take it one step at a time. In conclusion, Parentheses are used in mathematics to clarify numbers, to indicate multiplication, and to group numbers in the order of operations. Always evaluate the numbers inside the parentheses before moving on to any other operations when solving mathematical equations.